België kent heel wat straffe bedrijven. Hoog tijd dus dat zij laten zien wat ze allemaal in huis hebben. Welkom bij Alle Zaken op een Rijtje. Kunststofpanelen staan vaak bekend als massief, dik en zwaar, maar dat hoeft helemaal niet. Alle Zaken op Rijtje ging vandaag op bezoek bij een bedrijf dat innovatieve kunststofpanelen produceert. En ze hadden vandaag een internationaal congres hier in Brugge. Koen, your company develops plastic paneling, innovative. What's the difference between the paneling we already know? Traditional plastic panels are long, flat sheets uh, produced with an extrusion system. Mm -hmm. We create sandwich panels uh, using an injection molding process, which creates a very light and strong panel. So you have light and strong to replace a very heavy, thick panel. What kind of companies can benefit from that? What people don't know is that with plastic you can do exactly the same as metal. You can weld it together. So using our sheets you can start welding 3D structures which can be used uh, in different types of applications. Water, uh, swimming pools, uh, storage tanks, also air applications, solid applications as well as in infrastructure. Blijf kijken, want straks vertelt Malcolm meer hoe hij voordeel haalt uit zijn product. Malcolm, why did your company decide to try to work with lightweight plastic paneling? My company, which is located in Australia, is a plastic fabricator traditionally using solid, thin solid sheet material. Uh, several years ago at a trade show I found this uh, sandwich panel product which is, uh, adds a new dimension to uh, how we manufacture our products. And what are the advantages of this system? It's, uh, it's the lightweight uh, twin skin arrangement, uh, adds some rigidity to, to, the, to the material which means we can use it for more applications uh, and eliminating inclusion of steel, reinforcement and so on. Um, and we, it, it has expanded our product range. I don't know, introduce your company to us. Yes, I'm working at the NEDAP, the Netherlands Apparatenfabriek. We are based in Groenlo in the Netherlands and we work together with Paneltim in the pig sector. Okay. And what does your relationship to Paneltim look like? Uh, we are working together with them in the pig sector and we made the first central separation for sows in group housing. So we have big groups of sows and they need to be separated and we asked Paneltim how can we do it? So 18 years ago, I met Paneltim and the solution was there. And what kind of product specifically do you use from Paneltim? From Paneltim we use the panels in combination with uh, our products, so the electronic and the, the Paneltim product. And then we make a central separation, feed stations and also weigh units as well for mm -hmm. sows. Yeah. And would you recommend Paneltim to other companies? Uh, for sure I would, but not to our competitors, please. Claude, can you introduce me to your company? Yes, my company is IEL Technologies. Uh, we are located in Quebec, Canada, and involved in uh, swine and dairy uh, production of equipment. Why did your company make the transition to Panelton? We made the transition with them uh, because we have to look for another product to replace our uh, metal galvanized uh, fences. Mm -hmm. So we choose panel them for quality of their, their products and the strength of the panels. Yeah, what are the advantages of, of panel team? The advantages was the strength and the, uh, the uh, ability to uh, cleaning. So it's very easy to clean. It's a nice panel for biosecurity or something like that. And your company has benefited from it? Yes, the benefit for us is very, very nice because we double our sales in the last years with the panel products. Koen, what's the history behind Paneltim? Well, Paneltim was started 20 years ago 
by uh, a gentleman called uh, Ludo del, del Tour, who was active in the sales of plastic pallets. He uh, saw as an engineer an innovative idea to use a similar production process to create uh, sandwich panels that uh, could be used in big production. At that time, in the 90s, there was a booming business with big producers having to switch over from single units to group housing. Mm -hmm. uh, and in those group housing units, you had to make separation, divisions. They would normally be done in concrete or in metal, but using our panels, that was much easier. Lighter, stronger, and more hygienic. Yeah. Kuhn, it is a family business. Uh, is that a kind of strategy behind it? Indeed, Paneltim is a family-owned business. Uh, Family-owned businesses have certain advantages in the ever-changing market environment. The financial management of a, a family-owned business is uh, much like you would uh, manage your family budget, so very uh, long-term thinking rather than short-term investments. Secondly, you have a type of people that join uh, the company, so the recruitment profile for people is uh, more the type of uh, can-do mentality. So you have very dynamic, agile people that are there when you need them. Um, obviously, it makes you vulnerable also being a family-owned business because you're smaller compared to larger companies. But we can compensate that with uh, an increased service level and with a lot of inno innovation. Kun, how is the product made? We, use, uh, we combine two uh, plastic uh, techniques uh, that is in itself already innovative. We combine injection molding with plastic welding. So injection molding in the sense that we produce two half very large half panels. Uh, you need a very big machine to do that. Normal injection molding machines typically make small pots. We make a surface of one to two meter. It's very large. Those are ripped structures. And then we use a second technique, plastic welding, again, in a very large size rather than in a small size, uh, what you would normally do with plastic welding. So you take a mirror, you heat up the two half panels uh, on the ribs, you remove the mirror, and then you press, you press the two half panels together and keep them that way until they are closed together. And that creates your sandwich panel, which has ripped structure internally, and that makes it that strong.